I'll be starting out today's project with Dollar Tree floral wreath. And this is the square ones that they have at the Dollar Tree. They do sell the circular ones, but for today's project, I'll be using just the square ones. I'll be making two different DIYs with this floral wreath. And for the first one, I'll be using just two. I'll keep this two aside for now. And then I'm also going to be using Dollar Tree bath mat for this project too as well. I'm going to cut out the shape that I need from the bath mat and spray paint it gold. And I'll be needing just the shape of the inner square. I'm also going to be spray painting the floral wreath gold too as well. Now I'm going to go ahead to attach the bath mats to these. I'll use hot glue to attach the bath mat to this. For me, this is going to hold up just the way I want, but if you want it to be tightly secured, you can go ahead and use zip ties to attach the bath mat to the wreath. That way it stays in place no matter what. If you're new to my channel, it's so great to have you here. Now don't forget to click on the subscribe button and that notification bell so you don't miss out on any of my latest videos. Alongside the zip ties, you can also use a strong adhesive. And the zip ties can be used on all the four corners to keep the bath mat in place. Now this first DIY is just a wall decor. I was just gonna go for something decorative on the wall. So I used a nail and mounted this on the wall. So I have two here, as you can see. And you can also change the way this is being placed on the wall like this. Now I thought to myself that this will be even better if there are lights behind. So what I did was to add remote control push lights at the back. Now with this, you have a decorative and a functional piece on the wall as well. For the second DIY, I'm going to use what I already have on the wall the way it is, repeating the same steps as I did for the first DIY in the 9 made 4. I need this to be strong, so I'm going to be adding wooden dolls 
that will be cut to size and then added to the wrists. I'll be attaching the dowels to each of the floral wrists with zip ties. And I'm gonna be holding just the two ends and I'm gonna do it as tight as possible to make sure that they all stay in place. I'm making a DIY table and the dolls that I'm using is going to make what I got from the Dollar Tree strong enough to function as a table. I took this out and I spray painted the dolls gold. You can add a base to this and use it as a storage box. And it would still look so pretty and functional too as well. But this is gonna be used as a table. And I do have this round glass that I got from a thrift store and I will be placing this outside. For some reason, after I was done making this, it didn't look as good as I thought it would indoors. But when I brought it outdoors, it looked way better. So I'll recommend if you wanna use it outside, you have to use a stronger adhesive and zip ties. And you should also switch up the dolls for pipes that are outdoor friendly. From the very beginning, I love how you can have this on the wall. And you can also have a table. Like I said before, this can also be a storage box that can be used inside by adding a wooden base. Thank you all so much for watching. I have other home decor DIY videos that are linked in the description box below to check them out. And for those of you who have not subscribed to my channel, don't forget to click on the subscribe button.